What's up vlog? So it's like 1.30 in the afternoon and I started the day out with like, you know what, I'm not gonna do it today. There's just too much going on. Um, got like stuff to do for ta um, That's due tomorrow. Like some class notes for a professor. Uh, exam tomorrow. Uh, just got back from a meeting at Kent State with grad school. Had to make some edits to one of the files with 3D printing uh, because like, what was it? One of the parts was too too thin, and the 3D printing file or software didn't recognize there was a part in there, so I had to go fix that. Um, and I just I didn't think I was gonna do it today, but I at least want to make some form of vlog, and just because it's the consistency, and that's really it. I mean, that's all. The, the vlog just is designed to show the consistency and the opportunities that come i think are just the result of the consistency and um yeah so that being said it's 1 30 you know the typical we got up at 3 30 this morning uh trained and then was at the desk all day working emails things yeah. like that uh some drawings some homework for that I, exam tomorrow but uh, that being said it's just been a, a pretty typical day but right starting the vlog a little bit late but too much I'm trying to do. it's still going to be one of those kind of days so yeah. let's get after it from the moment i wake up so right now we are headed to a meeting with one of the companies that is sponsoring some of the 3D printing research uh, additive engineering solutions in Akron. So we're gonna go meet. We're gonna work on the design iteration and give us another step because um, it didn't quite work the way we wanted it to. So trying it again. I can't love a girl because I'm way too much in love with this. Different states, different countries. Re 30 just drove back to school just got off the phone with uh, a railroad customer doing some more customer discovery and um, just a little bit closer so it's always exciting but there's a lot of work to do and um, just uh, I want it you gotta want it and I had to pee so bad I've had to pee for the last half hour but this phone call was more important than peeing so See what happens. Uh, going to have a meeting in a half hour with some advisors on school at campus, and then uh, just get stuff done for school. I got an exam tomorrow. Four o'clock. Headed out to this meeting. So just got done with that two-hour meeting, hour and a half. Not sure if I am uh, more confused now or what, but so much to figure out. Um, it was with one lawyer, two lawyers, and then two business official professionals. I don't know what you want to call them, but just a lot to figure out. Just so many unknowns, trying to move fast, but trying to move right. Fucking stressful. So after that meeting, had a phone call with um, one of the guys looking to do the partnership company with, just discussing things. I mean, dude, there's so many unknowns. I don't think people fully understand the technical challenges that we're gonna be facing and we're facing right now. Uh, the regulation challenges. There's just so many unknowns, and just trying to get. <laughs> I just can't put into words the amount of unknowns, but figure it out. Real one, yeah. The moment I wake up, I stop packing all my stuff. Tell the homies, tell the family, 